Hi guys, and welcome to my very short review of Fear the Walking Dead, Season 6, Episode 3. So yeah, the latest season, it's kind of boring. Yeah. After this episode, I'm just like, man, they need to pick up this season. And get to, what get to whatever they're trying to do with Victor, because, man, I'm just getting bored. So this episode focuses on um, June and John, John's father. So yeah, spoilers, of course. With whatever I can spoil because there's not really much going on really. I could sum up I could sum up this episode pretty quickly, that's why I'm saying it's not really gonna be a long review. Yeah. So where should I start? So basically June and John have been living underground since the nuke happened because we we, we saw that at the end of um ep, you know, episode sixteen of season five when the nuke went off. Yeah. And you know, Teddy and Dakota got, you know, wasted. <laughs> there was indirect contact and you know, just, they just got wasted. Because basically when John goes up to look for something, he kind of sees Dakota as a walker and Teddy just destroyed. <laughs> yeah. But he puts Dakota out, out of her misery, I guess. But if he knew what Dakota did to her son, I mean, his son, sorry. Yeah, it's like, it's like I'm talking about June when I'm talking about John, the father, yeah. He probably would have left it there, or who knows, yeah. I don't even know what he'd do if he actually knew the truth. I and mean, we had a whole episode of June and John, and he didn't even talk about the person who killed John. Kind of weird, because that was a long episode as well. Instead, we got this storyline where John's father is reminiscent on things from the past, from what Teddy did, and since he just got back into contact with Teddy. I just don't know if that's what made him remember all these things that happened and all the victims of Teddy and the, and the people that he killed. Like, he keeps seeing them and just these, this weird storyline that I'm just like, whatever, I, I didn't really want this. Yeah, him just seeing the, the victims, but instead it's Walker's and June's just trying to protect him. And there's a moment where John's trying to kill June, like, just all this dumb stuff. And then those people who are out there trying to hurt them as well. And then by the end, you know, Victor finds them and Victor has them now. Then you see, you know, Morgan on the radio talking to Victor that if he does anything to hurt them, you know, he's going to kill him and he's actually not going to miss this time. <laughs> well, he's not going to miss like how Victor did. Yeah. Because when Victor tried to kill Morgan, he failed. Even though it seemed like he actually did kill him. But yeah. But yeah, mainly just a uh, average episode again. I mean, these last episodes have been average. I mean, the first episode was kind of interesting, but it just fell in the average direction. Episode 2, average. Episode 3, average. Episode 4 looks like it'll be better for the characters that it's focusing on, but still, still no Alicia. Like, where the hell's Alicia right now? I mean, the only clue we have for where Alicia is right now is that painting in episode one, whatever that could mean. I don't know if that's supposed to be like a walker and then she's like walking away. I don't know really what that means. Yeah. I don't know if she's been taken by the group that are actually attacking everyone or something else is going on, but we'll know soon. Yeah. So yeah, not really a long review. Just John's father just being... I don't know, messed up from what Teddy did to him in the past because he, he had a lot of regret and stuff from what Teddy did and he blamed himself for it and it's got even worse now after, you know, connecting back with Teddy before he died, yeah. So I just don't know if that's why it happened. But yeah, pretty much just a short review because not really much really happened, not really. Just June and John hiding underneath and John going a bit crazy, but then June gets him back together and makes him realise what's actually happening. Like, it's not, it's all in his head, basically. But yeah, I'll see you in the next one, guys. Let's hope the next episode's better. Peace.